to download your demo lesson, you will need to get Screencastify on your Chrome browser. To get that Screencastify program, you can either go to screencastify.com and download it there, or you can go into the Chrome web store and search for it and download it here. There it is. Once it's downloaded, you'll notice it's in the top right hand corner. It looks like a film reel. So this might be your demo lesson that you are recording. So when it's time to start recording with Screencastify, you can click on the icon at the top right and choose record tab. Don't choose record desktop. Make sure the microphone and headset are the correct ones that you want to use. And when you're ready to record, you can hit record tab. Okay, there it is at the top right hand corner. You can move it around. Um, if, if you see that it's backwards, like my welcome sign is, is wrong, you can click on this little button to change it so that's correct. Yeah. You can also make yourself bigger if you want to. <laughs> also, there is a little timer in the bottom left hand corner. And when you click on it, you can see that it's counting up. And it's funny because Screencastify, the free version of this, will only let you record for 10 minutes. But that's, that's actually okay because the demo lesson should only be 10 minutes anyway. So having this counter is very helpful. When it gets almost to 10 minutes, you know to wrap it up. And so you'll go through the whole lesson, say goodbye to the student, and then just let it naturally stop you. If you want to use the pen tool to draw on it, you have to select your pen, draw, and then select your cursor again on these options. When you scroll, the drawing goes up with it. If you click on your screen and drag it along, you can see your cursor move. So this could be another way that you are circling or underlining. You can make your cursor stand out even more if you do like this. That's another option. So when the 10 minutes is up, it'll just automatically stop the recording. But if you want to end it early, just click on the icon again, Click on stop. Now Screencastify will show you your demo lesson. You can review it. If you don't like it, you can always hit the trash can icon and, and start over. But if you like it, you can click share. Choose Google Drive and then make sure the privacy is set to unlisted. Click on upload and it will begin uploading. This can take a little while. When it finishes uploading, you can click on get link. Here is the link that you want to copy, copy link. And then you can paste your link where you need to, such as in the quiz document. Okay, so this link works. It shows my video that I just made. So I hope that helps with recording your demo lesson. And check out my next video where I show you five tips for nailing your demo lesson. Thanks, bye.